Hey guys, welcome back to my business, small business resources. And today we're going to go over uh, Gmail, Google Workspace inbox using stars and how to organize those. I've looked everywhere and I have three different Gmail inboxes that I'm checking every day. Um, two businesses is one personal and I needed a way for all this traffic to be more organized and I use stars but I wasn't happy with just the simple here change the stars here and then they're just showing up here so I did go in I did a little digging and I found a way to organize them like this so I have my inbox and then I have my starred action needed which I labeled all of these specifically to how I want pending and saved it's it, it's almost like a, a ticketing system um, but within your Gmail inbox so let me show you how to do it so we're going to start here with this my uh, test account so right now you can see that all I have is just the star and then the importance like this so we're gonna go over here to settings and we're gonna to go to see all settings to go into the back end here so we have general and we're gonna go down here to our stars so you can choose which ones you want so I kinda of like this red one it makes it pop out to me like I need to do something about it and this is just drag and drop inside here I'm gonna go here which is green and then we're going to go in and label these um, and organize them so these are the stars that we want to have so if you just go down here and save it you can now see how I'm changing these accordingly okay so let's go back into the settings we don't want to do anything with labels but we just do want to go labels are going to deal with what is over here on the um, left menu and you can actually go in and create new labels over here but that video is not um, that's not what this video is about today so let's scoot on over here to inbox okay now inbox type what I want to do is I want to go down here to multiple inboxes so what you need to do you see you have section one section two starred and is drafts that's just kind of the default that it's going to show up but we're going to actually label these in here to make it look like this okay and when you look here you can have them up and down um, just all in one pane or you can have different columns and section like that I like all of my inboxes over here that I have not read and then when I star them, they're going to scoot over here into this column. It's just a way that I visually um, is more organized for me visually. Okay, so how do we get in here? What we need to do is go back to general. We need to make a note of what are these called. If you just hover over it, this one's going to be called Red Bang. And this one is going to be called Green Star. So I'm going to go back to inbox and I'm gonna type this in as green star and this is has red bang and what do I want to name it so green star would just be saved you can label this however you want and red bang is going to be to do so you can go down here how many um, conversations per page I'm just gonna go 50 because I don't want any of them missing I want to have all of them viewable at one time so do I want the multiple inbox position uh, right of the inbox above the inbox below the inbox so let's just take a different a look at what these would look like so let's go right of the inbox and you're gonna see that's what I have it set up right now on my other account so you can see here here's my inbox I have not read these yet saved and to do okay let's go see what above the inbox looks like save to do 
and let's see below you can probably get an idea of what's going to happen here there you go inbox and your multiple um, labeled start inbox down here so let's go back and I'm going to go right of the inbox okay let's see we have multiple inbox position the reading pane okay you guys can go through here and kind of play with those things um, I don't have any filters going I just want my inbox set up nice and clean and easily um, easy to to view and easily organized so I'm going to save this go back in here so now let's say I want to save this email right here okay so a couple ways I can do that I can go over here and, and I've got the green starred so now you can see it's green starred here now technically it's supposed to be here in your inbox and over here in the saved okay let me just do a quick refresh you can see there saved and inbox now what if I only want it in my saved and not in my inbox you simply click on it and all you're going to do is delete the inbox label so now I go back here and it's out of here and it's only in here hope that makes sense leave a comment at the bottom if you have any questions I'd be happy to answer it please subscribe below so you don't miss my next tip and thanks for watching we'll see you next time